It's a disease that causes incredible pain all over your body all the time. Living with it also means having to get dozens and dozens of blood transfusions every year. That's what sickle cell anemia patients endure. Ross Gadotti has more about the disease that especially impacts the African-American community and a little boy who's taking it head on. Today's blood drive, of course, to help the public, but specifically this guy right here is battling sickle cell anemia. And today his family found out something they already knew, that he's not battling this alone. Right? My man. Seven-year-old Marquan Herring can best be described as follows. He's a great kid. He's, he's got so much energy. He is outgoing and he's spunky, he's courageous. He never shows that he's in pain. He never shows that he's sick. But Marquan is unfortunately very sick. Having sickle cell is a constant battle every day. You know, this is something that he lives with. But to continue to battle, Marquan and other sickle cell anemia patients need blood and a lot of it. Our sickle cell patients can get up to 100 transfusions per year. Now to help keep the blood supply up where it needs to be, Marquan School Urban Pathways K-5 through College Charter School hosted a blood drive. This is an amazing school. It's an amazing community. One after another, people who know Marquan and his family and others who simply don't lined up, laid down, and literally gave from the heart. It's so easy to save a life. Aaliyah Thompson and Marquan Sr. say their boy is certainly battling, but isn't letting the situation get him down. He's looking forward to, in fact, doing something a lot of kids like to do in the summer. And he likes to swim. And he swims. He will live in water if he could. He is my little fish, and he is amazing. That he is. In Pittsburgh, Ross Gadotti, KDKA-TV News.